Hi there, in this video we're going to look at how to use Yama Topics. Stay tuned. In this video, you'll learn what is an Yama Topic, how to create new Yama Topic, how to follow an existing Yama Topic, how to get the list of Yama Topics you are following, and, and lastly, you'll also learn how to get the list of all main Yammer topics in your organization. Okay, let's look into what is Yammer topic. Yammer topic is um, a keyword or a hashtag you use to tag updates in Yammer. Let's say you're posting an update about an online course, you tag the post with the hashtag called online course. Or for example, let's say you're you're putting an announcement regarding a marketing event that's coming along. Say so you you tag the post with hashtag marketing. Okay, let's look into how to create a new Yama topic. All right, let's go ahead and make a Yama topic. To make a new Yama topic, you need to post a new update in Yama first. Let's go ahead and create an update. So here we're asking a question about an online course on Office 365 for a building effective business solutions. Let's make the online course keyword as a Yama topic. To do that, just enter hash before the keyword. Now, go ahead and click post. As you can see, the post has been updated and you can notice that online course has become a clickable link. Now, we have effectively created a new topic. All right, let's learn how to follow an existing Yammer topic. To follow an existing Yammer topic, all you need to do is click on the topic. Once you're on the topic page, go ahead and click on the follow button. You are now following the online course Yammer topic. So every time someone makes a, a, a new update with this tag or the topic, you get notified. All right, let's go and uh, get a list of all the topics that you're following. In order to get a list of all the topics that you're following, you need to go and visit your profile page on Yammer. To do that, click on your name to open up the profile page. Once you're on the profile page, scroll down and you'll notice a section saying following topics. So here you'll see a list of all the topics that you're following. Okay, let's look into how to get a list of all main topics in your organization and so that you can actually follow them. Microsoft doesn't actually provide you with a direct link or a button on the Yammer interface to, to get to the screen. So let's see how we can actually get there. Okay, to get to the list of all the main topics in your organization, uh, you need to first select an existing tag or a topic. Just click on it to get to the, the topic page. In this case, I am on a, a topic page for YouTube. Once you're on the page, go to the address and delete everything as I show here. Okay, so just delete the, uh, the selected text. All you need to say is www.yama.com, your name of your organization, the and forward slash topics forward slash and click enter. There you have it. This page will give you a list of all the topics, all the main topics I should say in your organization. In this learning video, you have learned how to create, follow and list Yama topics. Yammer Topics is an important feature to make Yammer more relevant to you. In the next video, you will learn how to follow people, groups, and make your news feed 
clutter free. I recommend you to join cloud365.com to get more in-depth Office 365 training. Thank you. This is Jack Kakarlapuri, your Office 365 trainer, signing off. Bye.